Welcome to My Long Island TV. From Manhasset to Montauk, we have traveled our communities to bring you the following events. I'm your host, Waldo Cabrera. My Long Island TV starts now. Hi, my name's Nicole. I'm here with My Long Island TV at the Long Island Teeny Awards. And we have a great show for you. Are you nervous? Are you excited? What are you feeling right now? I think it's a little bit of both. Yeah, like yeah, we're, <laughs> we're anxious more or less. Oh, I'm a little nervous, but you know, nothing compared to being on stage. I'm excited to see the outcome of everything. Good luck to everyone, so. What interest do you guys in theater? Uh, I don't know. I just love going on stage and being able to be someone completely different. <laughs> I just love being a part of the cast and being part of like the theater community, and so it's just so fun. What are you nominated for tonight? Uh, best actor in a musical and best in uh, drama. So what did you think was the most challenging part about the role you played? Really finding the, just building the character, because it was such a different personality than who I am naturally. So it was kind of hard to come up with all the like nuances of who he was. But in, I think I did it pretty well. Our school is nominated for a Best Ensemble for the musical. It's Snoopy the Musical. This is our first like full-scale musical at our school, so it's great to be nominated. I'm nominated for Best Supporting Actor in a Musical. I played uh, Lord Farquaad, so I actually did the whole thing on my knees. Oh my god, did that hurt your knee? No, I wore knee pads, so I was okay. It was a little rough, but I, I pushed through. I'm performing Run Freedom Run from Year in Town, so we're the first group to go. That is one of my favorites. Are you nervous? Are you excited? How I'm do you very feel? excited. I'm very excited. I'm not nervous. I'm just hoping that that um, everybody in our show really gets their credit for how an amazing performance that we get on. Because we have, what is it, six nominations just from our one show. Yeah. I think it's great to get recognized for the work we do throughout the year. Yeah, I agree. I think that uh, high school theater is something that should be recognized for all the hard work that is put in. What are you wearing tonight? A black dress. I have no idea. I think it's from Target. Target. Target's awesome. My dress is from Macy's. Absolutely gorgeous. Thank you. Louis Vuitton. <laughs> you look absolutely stunning in red. What are you wearing tonight? Uh, Juno. What are you wearing tonight? Um, Ralph Lauren, I guess. I don't know what it is. I think my mom picked it out at Kohl's. <laughs> my junior prom dress. <laughs> can you do a little spin for us so we can see the whole outfit? Wow, you guys look great. I'm sure you guys are aware a lot of schools are like cutting funding and arts programs and being here and the Teeny Awards, how do you feel about that? Well, I obviously feel that we should put more arts as just as high as sports because this is a major thing that a lot of people are interested in. So I think that the number of people attending the Teenies and the fact that this is happening is really showing that we, this is also just as important as sports and other programs to fund. I think it's not really fair that they're cutting uh, after school activities such as musicals and art programs because not everyone plays sports and kids need something to do after school and it's how you meet your friends. Well at Bridgehampton we have a really small school so we just started our um, drama program two years ago and just to have a drama program in such a small school is an amazing thing that we could actually be able to do that and um, we're actually pushing to pass the budget so that we can keep the drama department at our school. And what does theater mean to you guys? Um, well, especially in my school, our department is very close to each other. So it's that sense of family and always being there for one another and sharing the passions that everyone has together. It's just something fun to do. Art is still prominent in Long Island and I'm so proud that they do this. Rock on, teenies, rock on.